Well, there were no upsets to be had in the Dutch Cup against PSV. We were outshot 15 to 2. They had possession. We had two shots, one on target, and lost 2 0. So, no upsets, no highlights to watch. Move along, nothing to see here. All right, let's take a look at the highlights from the Utrecht game. Nemeth comes in on the wing. It was cleared out, but it goes right to B B Baru. And Shedahal with a brilliant left-footed laser right into the corner of the net. And that puts us up 1-0 in the 13th minute. Just before halftime, Quazy lays it off to Nemeth. Nemeth looking for an opportunity, squared in, and it is McCowie who is starting due to the injury up front to our other striker. So we've got a 2-0 advantage in the second half. And that was a shot. It got hung up in the legs, and it fell right to Ubella, who puts it in and makes it 2-1. to one. Quazy coming up. Tried to pass it in, bounced off the defender's legs. Route one pass, beats Viral, and there's the equalizer in the 92nd minute. And that's how the score would end. Definitely lopsided in our favor. 17 shots to 11, 52 to 48 on possession. But we do have a habit of conceding a lot of late goals. So that is what happened in that game. Taking a look at what has gone on, uh, we had the 1-1 draw with AZ. Paul DeVries scored, and that got him his 15th of the season and a scoring bonus. A 3-0 win over Den Haag. Neteb with a brace. Paul DeVries added another goal. The 2-0 loss that we looked at earlier in the Dutch Cup. And then a 1-1 draw with Breda. Bunu got the equalizer in stoppage time. And the 2-2 draw where we gave up the equalizers late in the game, including the equalizer in stoppage time. So it all balanced out, I think. All right, we'll be right back for the match today with Willem. We've had a lot of players called up, eight to be precise, for international duty. Uh, so Hakan Varal and Tim Opdam go up for the Netherlands youth squads. Uh, Henry Vanderhorst, Coos de Chantier, Chantier, and Sylvain Francois, also for the Netherlands and Switzerland, uh, U18 and 19 squads. Heading off to Serbia's under-21s, Dangel Baljic, and Turkey will see Hassan Ince and Ilker Cesar going off for international duty there. These matches are not going to get any easier. We are doing our annual youth intake when, uh, <laughs> when other clubs release their young players. We try to bring them all in on trial, see if any of them are any good. Uh, I'm going to say no, no, possibly. Not, not seeing anybody in there that's going to make a difference. Maybe one or two guys that we might sign for depth on our youth squad. We'll see. I'll take a look at them later on. Getting into today's match. All right, we are going to go with McCowie and DeVries up top. Shedahull, Blondell out on the right wing. Merrick and Harms in the mid partnership. Banu, Nemeth in the mid. And Banachek, Neteb in the center. And Viral in goal. Blondell lacking a little match sharpness. I get it. That does happen. And let's see what we can do today. We are in blue and white. That was pretty aggressive for a kickoff instead of playing it back. They were going for it out of the gate. All right, let's encourage them here at the beginning. My eyes hurt so bad. I am so tired. <laughs> Uh, a couple of shots could not find their way through the box. 
So no credit there. Ball gets played out. We're on the defense. Oh, need to make a stop there, boys. All right, good, good patient ball movement. Shed a hole, makes a run, beats his man. That was a little optimistic. Probably should have done a little something different. Just saying. Vandermeer into the box. Oh, Barrow comes charging out. Makes the save near the spot. Oh, Shedahal. Nice first touch. Puts it on target at least. The keeper has to make the play on the ball. I don't know if I want him shooting that much. Nobody's on it. Vandermeer gets a free run on the ball. Nemeth closes him down. And oh, that had to be offsides. And it was. Let's demand more. Come on, boys. Come on. Back post. They're reviewing it, though. I think he was off sides. Looks like they're going to wave that one off. Disallowed. Ah. Little flick on header. Oh, he was... A step. I mean, he was clearly offsides, McCowey. Three yellow cards for them and a disallowed goal for us. Uh, let's pump our fists. We've been the better team. And let's demand more right out of the gate. Nemeth gets caught out of position, but closes in and then takes him down in the box. And I'm guessing that was not a penalty. All right, well, we'll, we'll go with that. I was pretty sure there was going to be a penalty there. All right, playing from deep in our own end. I don't know what he was looking at there. There's a nice ball up to DeVries. Squared in, and McCowie puts in his seventh of the season. And there is the 1-0 advantage. Liking that. Let's see. I want to look at... Let's bring in... Uh, you know, he's, not, he's a good dribbler, but he's a poor crosser. I'm going to bring on Fady Chelik on the side there. And I'm going to change him to a support role. And I'm going to switch both of these guys to attacking. We have Harms that's in a defensive spot. But I don't want these guys trying to shoot. Yeah, I think we're going to go with that. Let's see what that does. I would love to hold on for some points here. Oh, what a save by Varal. That was big. All right, we're going to go into the tactic. We're going to go back to that. Slow the pace down. And we're already playing for set pieces, yeah? Okay. All right, I'm going to drop Merrick back to the deep-lying playmaker. We're going to bring Wreckers in. I want to do that. That's going to be the move for right now. 
I want to get that yellow off the field. Merrick is really qualified to play that deeper role. He's been a good signing for us. And you can see them running the clock a little bit. Natib! Oh my god, we had... Looks like they had three or four cracks at the, at the goal there. Just could not get it through the legs. Hmm. Near post and cleared out. I am, oh, taken down, taken down. Dirty, dirty. All right, let's make another sub here. Shed a hole. Rasmussen. Let's make that move. All right, and let's phrase. All right, that lifts everybody up. Five minutes of stoppage time. Oh, it's going to be a long five minutes. Get it out, boys. Oh, DeVries with a nice run back to get control of the ball. Oh, look at the turn. If you guys have any suggestions on what to do to avoid that, because that's the most frustrating thing I, I see in this game in 21 is all the balls, it's like they're just a step slow on getting the cross in. I mean, look at that. Again, a step slow. Everything goes into a defender's legs. I don't understand I mean, I guess I could put on hit early crosses, but then, then you're hitting crosses from out here, not, not from deeper in the zone. DeVries can't get to that one. Tries to stay up on the defense. Oh, there's a dangerous ball, and it goes wide. I think Varal had a beat on that one, but wow. Two more minutes. No, oh, McCowie gave up on that one. Oh, Jesus. You know what? Maybe that's what it is. I'm going to take that off. Take off set pieces. And another late equalizer. Bogers just, he was all offsides, went back onsides. That was a good, good movement by him. And our guys just lost sight of him. Why, why are we playing it backwards when the goal's that way? Oh, my goodness. Merrick plays a 7.5. So we end up with the higher XG. Barely, barely. I mean, basically it says it should be a 1-1 game. I'm going to go hands in pockets. Yeah, well, you know, I don't know. That's brutal. So now we drop to 12th, but we have opened up a 14-point gap over NEC. So we were at 11 from the relegation. Now we're 14 they do have a game in hand, so they could get it back to 11, but will they? I doubt it. I doubt it. Let's see. Competitions. I think we're doing okay, guys. Of course, we don't have the Dutch Cup final, so that means we are going to finish up with Groningen and Ajax. I am going to do Groningen on camera, so we at least have an interesting match. And then we'll show the highlights from the Ajax match at the end of that episode. And that'll end this season. And uh, then we'll move into the offseason and see if we can build on this. You know, hopefully we don't fall apart. Right? I mean, that's five matches. That's 15 points to play for. 
we're like two matches away from securing our place for next year. I think that's the goal. So the board's pretty happy here. Board's very happy with the Dutch Cup. So we'll uh, we'll just see how that goes. Guys, hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Thanks for anything you do to share the word about the channel. Uh, you know, anything you guys do uh, is much appreciated. And uh, hey, we'll talk to you for the season finale in a couple of days. Take care. Bye.